for your entertainment. Enjoy. It's just the pressure I put in people's minds. Yes. Oh, the Lucina Spinos. I like that one, I really do. Because she, after I create her, she consumes the red resource, which means I can ignore the red from then on, and uh, she will just keep utilizing that resource to get more benefits. It's really cool. Now this thing, though, has six health. So this is the ultimate defender. Drown. Delta. Delta. Space 2. And he can... So he can either defend for 6 or attack for 3. So this is a really good idea because if my opponent doesn't have enough defense, I can pressure with it. If my opponent has offense, I can block with it. It's very... versatile. I'm going for the splitter into Lucina, I believe. Which means a Blast Forge build. I still haven't figured out for in memory how would be the best way to, to building a Blast Forge. But I think what I want most is just maximum dronage. Drone. I can be a little slower with my build and be okay with it. Delta. Delta. Echo. Space 2. But... I want economy. So let's get that engineer this time. Why would you be sorry? We are all happy for you, Johnny Carlos. He's just joking around. Don't listen to him. And my opponent is going for an earlier Brass Forge already, but I'm giving it up in, in the name of economy. Drone. Delta. 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 Space 2. Let's see if it works out for me. Or if he'll actually just beat me up. Let's see. I will have way more money. But then he's got a split steel splitter, so... He's thinking about it, how to put some early pressure on me, and I guess this is a militia. Mm. Now, I will lose one engineer, which costs me two, and I guess my drones maybe will make up for it. We'll see, we'll see. I have no way of defending right now. Delta. Drone. Delta. 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 Bravo. Space 2. But I am maximizing my economy in a way he never could, so... I'm taking a huge risk. Yeah, for him it doesn't make sense to get a third engineer, because he doesn't build three drones at the same time. The only way... The only reason I got a third engineer is because I'm utilizing that three energy so that I can get three drones. I really don't think it was purposeful for him to get the third engineer. Um, Space. And now I don't care about three drones anymore, because I can't afford that many. Drone. Drone. W. Delta. Delta. But this is lining up really nice. It's it's as if I planned it in my head all, all, the, all along. Um, I get a wall, maximum drones, and still a blast for it. This is just working into... A, it's working up into a great economy over here. Now, he's got 13 drones, and I believe I've got 17. Jeez. But I guess the militia can also produce money. It is kind of magical, the way it just lines up. It makes me feel way more competent than I am. Oh, fuck, I didn't commit? Damn it, I need to use my commands more precisely. Lost a lot of time there. I won't have as much time to figure shit out n later in the game. You got two keys! Johnny Callis, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it right after this game. After this game, I am immediately giving away... Uh, the Crusader Kings 2. If you want Crusader Kings 2 with three unit packs, buy the tickets for the giveaway right now because immediately I'm giving it away and I am opening a giveaway for Prismata Beta Key. Immediately. No warnings. So last chance for you to buy the Kings... to buy right now 
right now Crusader Kings tickets, because there's gonna be another giveaway right after it. Drone. And stay around, because you want this one. Drone. Thank you so much, Johnny Callis, as well. I love it. Thank you. What did I want? Bravo. Dr Delta. Delta. And then, apart from the Blast Forgers, I guess I, I wanted the Animus. Space 2. Two keys in the message. I loving it. Yeah, he got it on the Lunark Studios stream that is now streaming Prismata. It's the devs. And besides, by the way, Lunar Studios are doing really good Hearthstone uh, tournaments to promote Prismata, so... I've been watching every single game of those finals, and they were so epic. I learned so much about Hearthstone as well. Inspiring to play as well. Okay, so Omega split for my opponent. I will get him a little later. Drone. Which could actually put my defense in jeopardy. I may need a... I, I can't get a force field, never mind. Shit. He's not prompt now. So he can get uh, 5 attack if he wants to, and I have 5 defense, so it's gonna be a perfect thing. Which means I need a Rhino. Damn it, I didn't want a Rhino, but I have to get a Rhino. I guess that's the price I pay for so many more drones than my opponent has. It's interesting what he did with the Militia, because it still earns him money, but it forced me to defend. I guess it costs a lot, though. And I already have one Animus. I get another one, and then uh, the Lucina Spinos is available for me. Yep, so you're now buying tickets for Crusader Kings 2 with three unit packs. It's one of the most expensive things I've been giving away on this stream. And it's a really solid strategy game. Very... Very broad, general strategy game that might not be good for a stream, but if you're a fan of big strategy, like, overarching, gigantic thing, then... And politics is really good. Um, it's like a politics simulator. Um, um, um. Space. And now I can defend with Omega Split. Splitter. Drone. Delta. Delta. Oh yeah, I can make only one drone. I guess I need another Animus and a Tarsier now. Yep. Pretty much. Um. I'm gonna make this conduit as well. It's usually nice to have at least one conduit so that if I need to make force fields in panic or gauss cannons to boost my attack, I can do so. And green is the only resource that can actually stockpile, so I can just start producing it. It costs me only four, I have the money for it. I'm not getting more Omega Splitters? I can, actually, he's not a... Oh god, I can. Yeah, I could've. I guess I can next turn, because this turn I already have him. No, I could've built one more. But no, I want the Lucina. But I guess I could've saved money instead of making a conduit. That much is true. He's making more Splitters, oh shit, okay. Aggressive. Aggressive. Oh shit, yeah, this is pretty aggressive. Oh, it's pretty long, STR. I, I, I never played it, I just watched it. It's a grand strategy, so it, it'll take you some time. Um, um, space. Yep, I have to defend. Drone. But I have more economy. But I'm wasting that economy on walls. Damn it. He, this is so silly, because he's got momentum now. So he's committing his to attack, whereas I have to commit mine to defense. Unless I guess I spam three walls and then attack with this one, and take him by surprise, but that just kills one engineer, doesn't it? So that's crap as well. But I need the wall. Because he's at 11. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Actually, I need the force field as well. Whoa, nice catch. Crap, he's got just too much damage for me. I'm actually dying here. I'm not winning, I'm dying. 
How did he get those pixies? Oh, you can just buy pixies. It's a one-time, one attack. And it's really cheap. So I guess if you want to rush someone down, just break through the last legs of defense. The pixie is the way to go. If I can survive with my Lucina Spinos, I may be fine still, but crap. The way he got momentum from attacking first was really interesting. Like Now my Omega Splitter is used as a defender, but his are all used as attackers. But now that I'm putting more and more pressure on him... Drone. He can no longer... He, he has to stay with one and defend, so I guess that makes things easier for me, doesn't it? So I can wall... Um, what if I didn't wall? I guess then he just has a breach. But what if I just... I can't force field enough. Um, so I would need like two Rhinos? No, I, I, I'm trying to figure out how to make another Omega Splitter, but I can't. Um, um, I just cannot. I need walls, period. I could make Isochronos, actually. It's cost-efficient. Yeah. Shit. I am increasing in my attack. So he will have to... If he loses, if he starts losing splitters, I think that is game. If I can survive until the point where he starts losing splitters from my Lucina and Omega Splitter attack and Isochronus with Tarsiers and stuff, if I can survive to that point, I'm gonna be just fine. Lucina will be producing perforators every single turn, which will be decent attacking creatures. He gets more Blast Forges. I guess he just wants to rush me down with Pixies. He knows that the game is gonna be over pretty soon, so he just wants to blast me down before that happens. It may be a decent strategy, honestly, but the way he's investing in Blast Forges seems, I don't know, expensive. Home. Home. Space. He, he's stockpiling them for one gigantic attack. Drown. So I just have to have walls, otherwise... Um, um, I risk extinction. Which means I cannot really use my blue for Omega Splitter. Yeah, he, he can never kill Lucina, this is not happening. Um, so what I need to do, I believe... Um, get Pixies when I can. But get Tarsiers on uh, odd turns, and then on even turns, stockpile Isochronuses. Also one force field. So I just basically need to start, need to keep building up my defense to the point where... He, where I always have one more than him, right? A breach is when he has more attack than I have defense, and he gets to choose who to target from my attackers. <laughs> At that point, when he breaches my defenses, he can target my Lucina, and I will lose my main attacker, and I will pretty much lose the game. Oh, he just leaves. He disconnects. Oh, come on. No, I want this to play out. It's such an epic game. I just want to survive long enough for my Lucina to break through his defenses. Come on. Come on. Don't do it. Stay. I'm not claiming victory. But I am doing the giveaway. Oh. Raffle close. Enter. I'm gonna use this time to do the giveaway for Crusader Kings. 
41 tickets purchased, not bad, not bad. The game does deserve it. Who's the winner? Who's the winner? If you haven't followed my stream yet, by the way, if you just see me for the first time, you found me on random. And if you liked what you saw, you may want to drop a follow and I am murdering my vocal cords today. So tomorrow I may be offline to heal all the damage. So tomorrow you can find me on uh, youtube.com slash joyfulrogue where I am putting my most interesting things from Twitch. So you can just keep watching Joyful Rogue stream on YouTube. It would be nice if you dropped a YouTube subscribe as, as well as a Twitch follow. And just check out those videos as well. You can! I invite you! Consider yourself personally invited. To my humble abode. Alright, where are those keys? I think it's fitting, because Johnny Callis is the one who is contributing Prismata Key. He's the one everyone has to thank for the next giveaway upcoming right now. So I'm happy that he's the one who's winning right now. Home. Home. Paste. Home. 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 Very nice. My my Twitch chat just froze. Okay. Home. Home. What the fuck? Why is the stream on the ending screen? That's bullshit. Home. Home. Something broke when I did the giveaway. Something seriously broke. Oh, I got victory. Okay. Home. Home. Normal profile. Raffle open. Alright, now, in addition to youtube.com slash joyfulrogue, I, I will link you now on my chat to the joyful document. On the joyful document, you find the, the list of all the Let's Plays I did, organized in uh, convenient to watch playlists. All the lists are there, all the playlists with descriptions. You can just find the game that I play that you would like to watch and just enjoy it on your own schedule. It's right there on the Google Doc that I'm just linking to. So that's another way you can you can still stay in the stream when I'm gonna be healing up my vocal cords because, man, I am just overworking myself to ridiculous degrees. And uh, the giveaway right now is open for the Prismata Key from Johnny Callis. Keep in mind, it's a really fucking good game! Also keep in mind, in a few months, I, m I will be able to negotiate a couple, maybe a couple dozen keys from the Prismata devs. But for now, this may be all you get 